We've also got this. Last night's Raw, this being Monday, averaged 1.86 million viewers and 8.52 in 18 to 49, 8.24 in 18 to 34. Up from last week, it'll be very, very difficult for AEW to beat a .52 this week. The 2020 Raw draft did 1.85 million, but they did a .57 in 1849. So basically the same viewership, but the 1849 was much higher last year. It was an increase of 0.2% in audience, but a decline of 9% in 1849. May have been helped by the NFL game starting 32 minutes late. In fact, well, it's hard to say because the first hour did 1.95 million, but the second hour did 1.91 million. So it's not like when the game started, like everyone turned off Raw and watched the game. So to me, there's two possibilities here, and I don't know the answer. I know what I would like the answer to be because it would prove my argument, but I don't know actually what it is. It could be that uh, people were interested in the draft. Now, Last year, they weren't that interested in the draft, so I don't know why that would change. But the other thing that was different about this show is that, like, everyone's on the show. There is no brand split from now until uh, after the the Crown Jewel show. So it could be that having everybody available for both shows is, in fact, more interesting for viewers, which I have argued. But we will find out—we will actually find out which it is because— from now until Crown Jewel, you are going to see everybody on either show. The King of the Ring and Queen's Crown start Friday. It continues on Monday. So everybody's going to be on every show. And if the numbers are up between now and Crown Jewel, that's not the draft. That's all of the stars are on both of the shows. So we will find out why people watched in big numbers for this show over the next few weeks. Another thing to note about numbers, too, when it comes to last night's and tonight's are the Major League Baseball playoffs, which are taking place last night. Huge game between Boston and the New York Yankees that I'm sure is going to do monster numbers. And then I'm sure Dynamite's going to be affected tonight by the Dodgers and the Cardinals. I get a moment with more Observer Live. If you enjoy these videos for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of the Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.